Hello students, now today we'll do question number three where we have to express in the exponential notation. So some numbers are there. So we have to express all the numbers in the exponential notation. Okay, so now let's do. Now how to convert this particular number into the exponential notation? For that, the first thing that you have to do is you have to do the prime factorization of the required number. So we have 512, so the first thing we'll do is, we'll do the prime factorization. That is, it is divisible by 2, so it would be 256. Is second divisible by 2? 128, 264, 232, 216, 28, 24, 22, and 21 big prime factorization isn't it now what is the next step after you're done with this one what is the next step that you have to do you have to write 512 here and you have to write all the factors so how many twos are there counted one two three four five six eight nine so we'll write this one two one two one two three four five six seven eight and nine one two three four five six seven eight nine and how to write this product form into the exponential form so which is the number we are multiplying 2 so 2 would be considered as base and how many times we are multiplying 2 it is 9 so this is the exponential form of 512 i hope you have understood now so let's move on to sum number 2 of question number 3 sum number 2 we have 343 now we have to do the prime factorization of 343 now it is divisible by 2 no it is divisible by 3 3 plus 4 7 7 plus 3 10 10 is not divisible by 3 so this number is also not divisible by 3 so it is divisible by 5 no because the last digit is 3 now what is the next prime number 7 so let me see 7 is divisible by this or not it is divisible by 7 so answer would be 49 7 into 49 will give you 343 students now that is 7 7 are 49 7 ones are 7 so how to write this the next step 343 is equals to 7 into 7 into 7 so how to write into the exponential form 7 to the power 3 or 7 cube whichever way you can say okay now let's move on to sum number 3 so sum number 3 we have 729 so we have to do the prime factorization first so this number is divisible by 3 not with 2 but with 3 so 3 2 is a 6 3 4 is a 12 3 3 is a 9 again this is divisible by 3 3 8 is a 3 1 is a 3 27 is a 3 9 is a 27 3 3 is a 9 3 1s are 3. So now we have to write all the factors. That is how many 3s are there? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and 6. So that would be 3, 3, 3, 3, and 3. Okay, so how many 3s are there? 6. So 3 to the power 6. So this is the exponential form of 729. Okay, now let's do sum number 4. Now this number is not divisible by 2 as because the last digit is odd number. Is it divisible by 3? So we have to add all the digits that is 3 plus 1, 4, 4 plus 2, 6, 6 plus 5, 11. No, it is not divisible by 3. It is divisible by 5 as because the last digit is 5. So we will divide this number with 5 students. That means 5, 6 is a 30, 5, 2 is a 10, 5, 5 is a 25. 5, 1, 25 is up. 5, 25 is up. 5, 5 is up. 25 and 5 1 is up. 5. So we'll write this number here. So 3, 1, 2, 5. We'll write all the factors. That is 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5. 5, 5 is up there. So how to write in the exponential form? 5 to the power 5. Okay. So that's it for today. God bless you, take care and once again thank you so much.